I don't know if God exists. Deeply religious people are certain he exists. There are ardent atheists who are sure God does not exist. My posture is, particularly in the monotheistic traditions, that God is typically described as being all-knowing, all-powerful, and all-good. Yet I look back through history. In particular, there was an earthquake in Lisbon, Portugal. 80,000 people died. By the way, that earthquake took place on All Saints Day, in the morning, when most people, Lisbon, one of the holiest cities in Europe, most people were in church. So, people died in churches. Then there's a tsunami that basically wiped Lisbon off the map. Either God is not all good or God is not all powerful, but it's not clear whether God could be both of those at the same time for that event. So I take issue with what many people say God is, but there are other kinds of ways to think about God. There are enlightened religious people who would say God is the manifestation of the laws of physics in the universe. I don't have a problem with that. But is God the person who tells you who you should mate with and on what day you should eat what kind of food? And you know, is that your God? That's different from this other one that maybe just sort of put the universe into place. So I don't really concern myself much with it unless someone finds a way that any understanding of God can give me insight into making another discovery. That hasn't happened yet. There are many people who will see things happen to them that are in their favor. They say, oh, someone's looking over me. That's a fascinating phenomenon when that happens. And when you analyze those situations, what you find is, is that we as humans simply have a profound inability to understand statistics and probability.